my very first game day vlog as a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader. Good morning guys, it is 5am, I woke up at 4.30 and I showered and I did my skincare, so that's all done. But it's game day! Okay, I probably shouldn't be yelling because like people are definitely sleeping right now. But it's game day and I'm gonna get ready with you. First, I'm taking the Tula Beauty and it's like a primer and it, look, it comes out like this and then you rub it together and it turns orange. Orange to match my face. Just kidding, this tan is actually pretty good. It's dark on my hand, it's looking way dark on camera. Like I promise in real life it looks like really good, but my tan on my face never is as dark. So I don't know how much I'm going to actually vlog of like actually being there like in the locker room at the game because I just wanna be respectful of everyone else's time and we're all gonna be like pretty rushed and stressed. And I don't have a foundation yet, I don't have a good foundation. I'm pretty locked in on my other products, but foundation is where I still, I'm like, don't know what I'm doing, so. Now I need this to sheer out, like I don't need this much foundation. The game is at 12 p.m. We have to meet for the bus at 7.30. Now 7.30, you're thinking not that bad, but I guarantee most of us are getting up at like five, 4.45 if you have to shower like me, using my Kosas concealer that I'm obsessed with. And I do like a darker shade first, and this one for blemishes, cause it matches, and then I'll take a lighter shade to brighten my under eyes. This is the first like real home game. And so I've heard from vets that it's almost like an even completely different experience because like if you thought the preseason was cool and like there's a lot of people and like crazy, like apparently I'm gonna think this is even crazier and like even cooler. And I am really, really, really excited um, for that adrenaline rush. It's been a while since we did the preseason game. So like, I have to say, like, me and, like, the rookies are feeling nervous because we were kind of on, like, a high of, like, back-to-back, -back. like, meet the team, preseason game, blah, 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 and then, like, it just kind of stopped for a while. So, I am a little nervous. Before we set the under eyes, I'm going to do my liquid blush as well, and today, I switch up the blush, like, all the time. So, today we're going to do the uh, YSL because I can't say the actual name of it. Like, I don't know how to say it. So, we're going to do the YSL liquid blush. And this blends out so smoothly. It's so creamy. It's kind of like putting on like a little lipstick, but not sticky at all. I'm going to take a white translucent powder and a little powder puff, which I should probably get a new one, um, and set my under eyes. I do like using more of a pinky pigmented translucent powder, but I did run out of that, so I'm on to this one. Last night, I like, oh, you're falling. I'm using an Octo Buddy for the first time. I'm so excited about it. Last night, I like laid out all of my products so I wouldn't be scrambling through a makeup bag at 5 a.m. and then like getting mad at myself for not knowing where anything is. So I'm like stoked about this setup. We're just gonna take this shade called Nana Pudding. Oops. And put that over my whole face, or no, my whole lid. With a big fluffy brush. I'm gonna take this darker color called cookie butter. Mmm, love me some cookie butter. And start putting that in the crease. I normally take way too long on my eyeshadow and it's so unnecessary, so I'm gonna try and hurry today. I'll get the same outcome, like seriously. As long as I just keep blending. People tell me that I'm good at my eyeshadow, I just don't know if they're lying. Now I'm gonna take more of a dense brush and do the darker color chestnut and go more on the outer corner. 
I said a vlog was coming soon, like a month ago, but just like being a rookie, I wanted to make sure I was in my place and like wasn't doing anything wrong or overstepping. So I do want to try and incorporate vlogging and YouTubing because I've done that even before DCC in college. And I've always wanted to do it like my whole life. But at the same time, I want to make sure I'm doing everything respectfully. And yeah, you know, just staying in my zone, in my place, staying focused on actually doing the job aspect of being a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader. Now I'm gonna take this purpley brown shade called Tree, put that on the outer corner as well. I'm gonna take this flat brush and do a little bit lighter of a purple, maybe a mix of these two to go on my lid. I'd never know what to do with the lid, if you want me to be honest. Like, I know I can like put a shimmer, but if I don't want to do a shimmer, what do I do with it? Now I'm gonna take like a dense brush like this. It's like a flat brush, but more dense and carve everything out with this shade called Rice Pudding. Okay. This is my favorite part is getting that nice sharp edge. We're gonna go back with that dense brush and do the under eyes, which just, in my opinion, completes like the whole look is doing under eye eyeshadow. I'm gonna take this flat brush again and do a little butterscotched. Yeah, there's a D on the end. Shimmer in here. And you know what I'm gonna try today is use this dips product on my decollete, I think is what it's called. I'm gonna do my bronzer next. And today, instead of using the Kosas bronzer because it is shimmery and I want everything to be more matte, I'm going to use this one, Ravalon from like CBS. Maybe we'll do more of a peachy one. I have this Lady Gaga blush in Pomelo Peach. And my boss used it on me for a makeup tutorial and then let me keep it, which was super, super sweet. I think I'm gonna do that today. Why not? Okay, and then I think I'm gonna take this Dips blush and go on top a little bit. There's more of a peachy shade right here, but a little brighter. Get out of this hair towel. And now that it's like all matted down, lovely. First thing I'm gonna do is take this Avita strengthening leave-in treatment. I believe it's like a bond repairing treatment and put that all over. I will say my hair was freshly done for Meet the Team in the preseason game so bright and blonde good roots and like it's obviously not going to be for every game because i can't get my hair done like whenever i want like you gotta wait like six to eight weeks or it's gonna fall out so i won't be as happy with how my hair color looks take this kristen s leave-in conditioner because it's something i can put more at the roots my hair gets super tangly after showers. My favorite brush of all time. I went on a rage on this on another YouTube video, but it's the Tangle Teaser. It is better than the wet brush. Um, better for your hair. All hairdressers are starting to switch over to these now as well. And I had a really bad problem with my wet brushes building up all of that like debris and like lint. If you know, you know, because I know some people have that problem as well and you quite literally can't get it off. I would soak my brushes, I would take tweezers and scissors for hours trying to get it off, and you cannot get it off. And I looked it up on the internet, and it's like a buildup of like lint from towels, like when you put towels in your hair, product, dry shampoo, dirt, and I couldn't get it off because it had those little like tips on the end. 
well, I broke mine, but Tangle Teasers don't have those tips on the end. It's just like the bristles. So hair comes off of them way better. They don't have that product build up. I do need to soak this one. We could use a good wash or get a new one. So huge fan of Tangle Teasers. Avita Scalp Solutions Protective Mist. Hope my scalp doesn't dry out when I use the Shark. Same brand, Styling Mousse. And last but not least, before I pull out my Shark and use heat on my hair, I'm gonna take this Argan Oil Heat Protectant Spray. And so I've always used protectant spray like when my hair is wet, not always, but for a long time. But I never had like a dry spray for like using a flat iron on my hair when my hair is dry. And I finally got that yesterday. I just got one from TJ Maxx and it's that Chi brand. Is that how you say it? It's red. So my shark is going to be loud. So obviously I'm going to like time lapse this next part, but I'm going to take my shark and I'm going to do no attachment for now and just blow dry the roots. Now you can do this a few different ways. Um, if I had oodles and oodles of time, I wouldn't blow dry the roots at all. I would let my hair air dry for the most part and then just take the brush part and smooth it out. But my hair is like pretty wet and I don't have all the time in the world. So I'm gonna take the blow dryer part and just do the roots. I'm gonna use my oval brush attachment. I'm sorry if you see some hair in there. Yeah, I should clean this out. Okay, I'm so sorry to whoever lives below me. I'm gonna take clips. So how I do this is, ouch, my hair is tangly. Ow, I section out my hair. And pin this all up. I have it on the highest setting and the highest heat. I've got my Rebel on. We do the full game day rehearsal and practice in this. So. I have this on, I'm gonna put my warm up jacket on and finish everything up. I might put a sweatshirt on actually. I'm gonna take this brown eyeliner and do my waterline. Little tiny baby. Yeah, I don't know how to do that. Eyebrow pencil and fill in these eyebrows. My eyebrow lamination has like completely worn off, so that's sad. I'm gonna have to really focus on gluing them down today. I cannot wait to get another one. I think I get it next week. I like do not want these to move, so I'm using another product. Now they won't move. They may seem a little dramatic, but I also remember I'm on a field and they need to look like they exist since they are sparse and blonde for the most part. I'm using milk mascara, milk makeup mascara. I might have to do black liner in my waterline to make my eyelashes look a little bit more together. If you wanna watch me pack for game day, go look for that on my TikTok. I didn't make my bed and my TV stand's coming in the mail early. But we have time for a quick breakfast. I'm thinking it's some oatmeal with some peanut butter. I wish I had fruit right now, but I don't. I have some granola in there. And randomly I might do like two pieces of like microwave bacon. I'm a Kroger shopper. I don't know about you guys, but that's all they had like in my college town was Kroger, which was new to me. At home we grocery shop at Walmart. Um, and so I have a Kroger card and you can get everything Kroger you get money off tip for anyone. I think Kroger and Aldi is like the cheapest option. You're on my microwave right now, so. Shout out 
I do a little practice right now, I won't fall over today. Oh, my hip just popped. I'm gonna make my bacon, eat real fast, and go over the packing list to make sure I have everything. So I will talk to you guys probably on the bus. It's at this moment where I just pray to God that I have everything. Went through the packing list twice. Oh gosh. We just pray. I'm picking up my mobile order and I look out and I see a black Frenchie and I have a black Frenchie at home so this is gonna be a good game we're gonna win and I'm gonna do great just because I saw a black Frenchie my hair will look better later I promise Trinity what time did you wake up this morning 4 a.m. Oh, what time did you wake up this morning Wait. for a 12 p.m. game like 5 15 oh not bad <laughs> Sophia what time did you wake up this morning for a 12 p.m. game you feel I wake up I woke up at 6.45. No, at 5.45. <laughs> what time did you wake up today? I woke up at 4.45 in the morning. Yep. Hi, everyone. Oh, look at my gold yeah, oh, my We're on the way to the game. Oh, my gosh. Oh, gosh. Wow. Golden hour. Hello, Sophia. <laughs> her hair. Oh. That's how you know it's her. <laughs> it's her. Oh wait, this is harder than I thought. Yeah, the back of the bus is a little bumpy. Wait, what's that? Look, Look at her, she's blowing in the wind. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look, this, hair, hair this hair has movement and volume. She's eight foot crazy. This is like a little shark. Yeah, it's like a shark. Look at her hair. Will you send me the link to yeah. that? No, Can I see it? Look. Yeah. Guys, this is like a little Put Dyson. It in the Put it in your shirt. Shirt. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Like, you know like, there, we're yeah. doing you game day games. Like, in your boot. And, and then, then it out. We'll practice immediately. So it's going to be quick turnarounds. If you didn't know, we do game day gifts. Okay. <laughs> okay, now. Steady on the road. Doing makeup back here. Mm -hmm. Ariel, good morning! I missed you! <laughs> As you can tell, we are rushing to practice. Hello, is this the vlog? This is the vlog. Happy game day! Happy game day! <laughs> Look at these cute little hangers I got. Oh, that's cute. Yes! Aren't they so cute? That is I know, the lady who sent me them was so sweet too. That's adorable. No, I remember you telling me. Yeah. The priorities right now are unpacking and changing. <laughs> this is, um, it was locked <laughs> How many times have I vlogged and not posted anything? And I promise I'm going to post this one. I'm going to post this one. Okay. Um, <laughs> I need a clean up. <laughs> no, that's what I was just going to say. I've got to find a better We need a clean up. We have a whole corner to ourselves. Yeah. We need to be using it's it. It's bigger than everyone else's and it's a mess. Here are my game day gifts. It has my name on it. Do you see C in there? Oh my god, it's so cute. I love it. It's adorable. No, I'm obsessed. These. And we got a perfume too. Signature scent. Signature scent and it smells so good. No, it good. literally, I wish you could smell it through the camera. It smells so Cheers. good. Cheers. Okay, I'm, are you ready? Yeah. I'm most exci <laughs> excited. <laughs> I need to freshen up. I really just need a powder and get rid of this creasing. <laughs> My bestie Ava's vlog. Whoa, sorry. <laughs> I think the apples are to the core. Oh, that's so cute. Hi guys. Hi guys. Oh gosh. I know you probably don't know who this one is, but. <laughs> 
size no one. Oh, I need some bronzer. I sweat it all off. Yeah, I, I just. Your face looks so much tanner than mine. Okay, I got a Thank you. I just use really pale concealer on accident. Oh, so. look at this double vlog. I don't know what happened. No, I it's Cake it's Central. I know you here. too. And I, I don't know what happened, but I look like hey. actual cake batter. <laughs> Yeah. I'm like wrinkly. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do a group stretch. Yep, good stretch. We are going out, so I'll talk to you later. I'm ending off the vlog. Good night. Happy game day. I know we didn't win, but the cheerleaders always win, right? So good night.